Fawn Riders Little Fawn Hair Scramble. I've had a lot of you come up to me and thank you, and thank me, that is, for taking on this date. I'll be honest with you, I found out on Facebook. And to get through the ugliness first, we are a motorcycle club. We are not your trash service. You brought it here, you take your slimy civilian trash home with you. Next item, your demon spawn, that'd be your children, are done pit riding. Their race is over. I don't want to see any pit bikes out there. Here's the problem. Somebody, little Johnny, is going to get injured or he's going to cause an injury. I don't want you slimy civilians trying to sue me for your lack of parenting. Park them. Is there any doubt on what arrow you're following today? Well, I don't hear a response. Your arrow is white. Background with a black arrow. That will be the only arrow you follow. There might be an erroneous green one over here in the front section. You'll ignore that arrow. Follow your white and black. There is gobs of ribbon out there. You will ride where that ribbon guides you. Do not ride under my ribbon. I can promise you what's under that ribbon is a place you don't want to go. Your course today is 10 miles in length. It is a very easy course. I took pity on you soulless mouth breathers. <laughs> There's a few danger X's out there. Typically I have some drop offs for you. You don't, it doesn't require any special skill. You can just nose down and go. I don't recommend you shift up and throttle. Your start will be the same place as in June. If you're new, you'll go down this main road, turn right, there's signs to guide you. You will do so in a calm, orderly fashion, single file, and line up by social security numbers. You will have one minute interval starts. There are mileage markers every half mile out there. Scoring is mile 10 or zero, proceeding. If you get lost, break down or whatever, and decide to walk back, tell us what last mile marker you were at, and it'll speed up the process to extract your bike out. As always, we have an excellent EMT staff. That's Mr. Ted Gibbons, right there. And Anna. My goal is that's the only time you see him today. Should be your goal too. Behind me we are selling pizza for you. And in October we're going to host a vintage motocross. Gives you a chance to uh, play on the old stuff. Now, I will open up. Are there any questions? All right, question was the distance to travel to get to this moto track. I can tell you from the start to scoring is two miles. To answer your question directly, you won't see that moto track toward the end of your lap. Yes, sir. Are we going to stop at scoring the first lap? Just two miles? You do the 
Yes. What you always done, slow roll, in control. No bypassing score, just go through. After two miles, you should be strung out enough. I'm sure Zach will give you more clear advice on scoring. Anything else on the course? Outstanding. I think you guys will like this. By the way, tell me what you think of this course compared to back in June. Like I said, it's a less challenging course. If this is what you guys want, I will accommodate you. You pay the bill, I produce the service.